Okay, Senpai, we've collected all we need for the barbecue. Now all we have to do is prepare it. Hmm? It looks like there's another battle going on over there. Let's go check it out. Right, Master. It's Anning. It looks like she's on her own. And I think... Is she doing some hunting herself? Scree! Eep, when did it get so close? Knock it off, Plessio. Scree? You said your name was Wokey, right? You've been helping Bunny, haven't you? Yep, I'm one of Super Bunyan's employees. Even so, you still worried about my baby here, didn't you? I don't want to fight it if I can help it. Hmm, is that so? Well, aren't you a big softy? Okay, then how about we agree to go our separate ways? You got it. Good, I'm glad you're quick to understand. <laughs> Be careful out there, chumps like you always get the short end of the stick. Is it me or has he lost some weight since last time? No, he hasn't. He's still got plenty of growing to do, both in size and strength. I'm going to raise him to be emperor of the whole damn Jurassic period. And when I do, I'll settle the score. So that probably means I'll have to fight you too. Well, see you later, Wookie. Come on, Plessio, let's go. Scree! Anning seems kind of tired to me. Surviving on a Jurassified Mississippi River must be harder than she even expected. I thought she was the one who wanted this, though. Maybe she's training for something. Or maybe... Master, I think it's time we headed back. Bunyan and the others are waiting for us. Felicitations, the barbecue's all ready to eat. We've got plenty of maple syrup too, so use all you like. Let's eat. Looks like everyone's in a much better mood now. Of course, we ain't seen a dime yet. You will, I promise. I just need a little more time. Hey, can I ask you something? Why isn't the real babe here? Wouldn't it save money to draw a bigger audience? Babe changed at some point. I guess that's just what happens with childhood friends. Gotcha. Now that you mention it, you are a little more grown up now. But you're also more... Normal? Normal? Me? No, I'm not. Well, just look at you. You're not even all that tall anymore. I'm not my child self anymore, okay? These days, I'm all about symbolic growth. The ancient giant might have been at home in forest, but... As the latest model, I'm happy with attention and likes coming in through my little social media window. This statue is for all my supportive employees. This is how everyone sees me. Hmm, but it's, well, not that cute. Huh? Let's drop this, please. Yeah, let's. I'm the leader and host of the party, so how can I expect everyone else to have fun if I'm not. Hey guys, watch me chug this gallon of maple syrup. You're gonna drink it? I'll help. There. Thank you. <laughs> ah! Our foe is a formidable one. We must keep our guard up. 
You think I don't know that? Of course I do. But, um, maybe we should have stuck to hunting something a little easier. We need nutrients. Our own safety is a distant second. Don't you even know that, me? Yes, yes, of course I do. Oh, jeez, oh, jeez. If worse comes to worse, we can always multiply. We give thanks for this bounty. We got them! Yay! Um, how are we going to feed all this to him? Good question, me. I can tell you didn't think that far ahead either, me. Well, this is a pretty pickle. What do we do? What do we do? Scree! Lord Plesiosaurus. Fancy running into you two. What are you up to out here? You're here too, Boss Anning? Perhaps this is the Buddha's guidance. Please take this. We hope to give it to you. This freshly caught Mississippi whale is full of nutrients. We hope Lord Plesiosaurus likes it. You know, I've been watching you two hunt for a while now. Uh, oh, I see. You'd have been very happy if you helped us. Hi, and why would I do that? You're right, I'm not even sure why I said that. Come on, me. You should know better. I'm sorry, I guess this means Boss Annie really isn't our boss anymore, then. Oh, for Listen up. Yes, what is it? If you want to serve me, that's your choice, but I'm not going to thank you, pay you, or anything like that. You okay with that? Oh yes, thank you, thank you. Well then, guess I'll take you up on your offer. Go on, Plessio, chow down. Scree! And when you're done, we'll head back home to your Takurabune, if that's okay. Of course it is. I guess we got off on the wrong foot. You'll forgive me though, right? Here, how about a makeup hug? Oh, uh, okay. You said your name was Rwoki, right? You'll join my companions, right? Right? So please, Woki, help me stop Lancer. Thank you. That's it. I look really cute. A new ride would come through. Though, of course, it helps that she has such a great subject to work with. But this still isn't nearly enough. Hmm. Let's put the full-length mirror down here. Here. How about a makeup hug? You'll join my companions, right? Thank you. Hmm. No, not quite. Thank you! Wait, is someone there? Just an ordinary passerby. Wokey? Well, that's okay then. I'm sure you can keep a secret. Don't tell anyone about this, okay? I don't know. I didn't know you practiced this stuff. Don't worry about me or anything. I'm doing this because I like it. I want to be even cuter than I already am. That way, everyone will like me and agree to be one of my employees, right? And don't tell me I'm already cute enough, okay? I'm gonna go above and beyond. Ideally, I'd like to be cute enough to say, stop a war with a smile or make someone feel like they died and gone to heaven with a hug. If you could do that, you'd basically be a god. Not even close. I'm no god, no hero. Though maybe I could be if I wanted to. But if I were, I could easily solve every problem myself and then nobody else would ever need to grow or learn. That's why I want my employees to always be giving their all. 
I want them to ask themselves what they can do to help me, to help the world. How can they be useful? The way I see it, if they really like me and they're the one of my delightful and companions, then they'll do everything they can to make the world a better place, right? Is that what you mean by myth? Remember what I said when we first met Wilkie? I said I wanted to make myths together. I meant it. I want to change the world and make new myths and that'll support it all the same time. That's why I was summoned here. That's what I've been working towards all this time. So I'm not a god and I'm not a hero. The best I can do to make the world I want to see is gather companions and decide the roles they'll play. That's how I've made all these cinematic myths. I know most of them have been failures so far, but I'm still not giving up. I want to create myths, stories people around the world will love, admire, enjoy over and over, think about, and discuss for generations. Making movies is the only way I can do that. Writer said basically the same thing. Oh, well, I'm basically just repeating what she always says, but I really do believe that I made this choice to. I want you to help me make that happen, Wilkie. I've even got a new script all ready to go. But it might need a few rewrites. Plus, I just got a great idea for the last scene. I'm sure the script will be a success. That's why it's going to be the last movie I make. I can't tell you what it's about yet, but you'll stick around to see our movie. Our myth get made right, won't you? I can't wait. Trust me, I promise it's going to be a masterpiece. I'm home. Whew, I'm exhausted. The hell? Who are you? Not to worry. One of them is one of us. And the other is Lord Assassin? Ooh, do you have something for me? Yay! Don't take it. It can't possibly be anything good. Is this a map? It looks like it shows the locations of various prehistoric creatures living near the Mississippi River. I suppose these skull marks warn of contaminated areas. This could be a great way to locate new sources of nutrients for Lord Plesiosaurus. I don't understand. Why would you give me something so useful? Are you leaving now? Do take care on your way back, and thank you for the wonderful gift. Huh? Does this mean one of Bunyi's minions snuck aboard the Takarabune while we were away? Then why didn't they just try and take it back? Maybe they're just really nice. What? No way. That's... No! What? Could it be? Nah. And anyway, now we can be sure you'll have an especially nutritious meal tomorrow, Lord Plesiosaurus. Scooty! No, seriously, why? 